if anyone in Omaha knows hot dogs, it's Ryan Berry. When my wife and I first met, she just assumed that all I ate were like hot dog or hot dog like things. Which, when one looks to start a hot dog business, will always be an asset more times than not. However, when starting a business right before a pandemic, and going into a time where access to startup capital is more difficult than ever, according to the U.S. Chamber of Commerce, Willie Docks has been able to ride the wave into becoming the masters of their destiny. That destiny? Barry says that Willie Dogs is on a crusade to create the definitive Omaha-style hot dog. So the, the goal has always been, uh, from the get, to create something that's synonymous with the city of Omaha. So you come here for Berkshire Hathaway, or you come here for the College World Series, and it's like, you have to get a Willie Dog while you're in Omaha, because you can't get them anywhere else. You cannot. Curtis Mast, InterRail's hospitality director, had something of a similar idea about putting a hot dog joint in the InterRail. And when he met Willie Dogs, he found exactly what he was looking for. And he doesn't seem to be alone based on the buzz surrounding the store's opening. It's, it's wild because this has been one of the most anticipated food ventures that we've put in here. For some reason, he just has this spark from. According to the Brookings Institution, the creation of a city's identity is rooted in part in rooting an image based on local assets. As Nebraska is one of the most prolific states in terms of cattle, according to Wise Voter, it's natural to begin to build that identity through what our state does better than almost anyone else. In layman's terms, you don't have to look far, even in urban Omaha, to answer the age-old question, where's the beef?